CBS 21's Heart to Heart is sponsored by Wellspan Heart and Vascular. Cardiac events can be major life-threatening events that come on suddenly. Medical technology has enabled doctors and nurses to monitor heart health remotely for those who suffer from cardiac disease. Ed Russo explains in this month's Heart to Heart. Cardiovascular disease is the leading cause of death for men and women in the United States. And if you suffer from heart disease, new devices are making monitoring your heart easier. The entire WellSpan system has about 9,000 patients that are followed uh, for implanted devices. And that could be pacemakers, that could be internal defibrillators, and that's also implanted cardiac monitors. Depending on your cardiac condition, some of these implants only monitor the metrics of your heart, but other devices can actually help treat certain conditions. We also have pacemakers, which are basically, when you think about it, like a backup generator for your, your house, uh, it's like a backup generator for your heart. So when your electrical system is not working correctly, pacemaker is what is utilized. These pacemakers have conveniently downsized over the years. Certain devices can also treat irregular heart rhythms. And they also function as a uh, preventative device to help if a patient has like, a serious arrhythmia. These implanted devices measure the patient's heart metrics and upload them to an exterior device. Most of these patients have a monitor that sits by their bedside at home. And through telemetry, through Wi-Fi, those devices connect. Um, and what it allows us to do is it allows us to see at home what the patient is doing to be able to, you know, make sure that their devices are functioning um, uh, the way that they're supposed to function. The patient's heart metrics also get uploaded to this monitor when they are nearby. The metrics are then delivered to an office computer that doctors and nurses can look at. Isn't technology amazing? With remote monitoring and how we've converted more to remote monitoring than having to have the patients come in, I think it's convenient for patients. Um, I think it's reassuring for patients to know that somebody's watching what, what's going on with their devices. I think that the technology is going to continue to grow. Ed Russo, CBS 21 News.